I'm walking down the street on clouds instead of the concrete. I'm dancing through. Everything's about to come my way. Nothing can ruin my day, no matter what anyone does. Hey guys, say, welcome back to another video. If you're new here, no, my name's Amanda. I'm so glad you're here. And welcome back to those that have been around for a while. I've missed you guys, and I'm sorry for it being a week and no video, but it's just, it's been a crazy week, and I've been really tired, so, but I've got one for you today. I'm doing some cleaning, and I'm sharing a grocery haul. I combined the two. So I hope you enjoy. I hope that you're motivated. I thank you so much for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you. I hope you're having a fantastic day and I hope you enjoy the video. Yeah, I am on my way. I won't slow down. Yeah, I am on my way. I won't slow down. I'm strolling down the street with all of my favorite songs on repeat. I'm dancing through. Everything's about to come my way. And I don't care if you spill coffee on me or if the sky is gray or blue. No, I don't care because I am on my way up. And I won't stop. I won't slow down. Standing on my feet, I'm going to rise up. No, I won't stop. It is my time. I know what it's like to be broke, yeah. I know what it's like when nothing goes your way. So I'm gonna let my amazing grace. So guys, we've come to the part of the video where I share the devotional from the Pocket Bible Devotional for Women by Norma Rossio. Linked but not affiliated. And today, well, not today. It's a devotional from a few days ago, but it says, Think before you complain. And the verses are from Philippians, Isaiah, Ephesians, Psalms, and James. And it reads, Have you mastered the art of complaining? Complaining to others, to yourself, to the Lord, about your husband, your boss, things that didn't work, the weather, ingratitude, and discontentment is the source of many complaints. Before you complain about the long line, remember you've got legs to stand on. Before you complain about the hot car, remember you've got transport, you've got transport while others don't. Swap your complaints for gratitude. And got that convicted me i mean really convicted me i complain sometimes probably better than most and that's it's embarrassing for me to admit to you guys but that's i do i'm i'm very guilty of that so i'm thankful for that and i hope that i can the lord will bring that to the front of my mind when i want to complain well it's raining or it's hot see the good in it instead of complain be grateful for what we have and guys i appreciate you letting me share this with you i hope it was an encouragement to you as it was to me
So guys, I went to Ingles and then another, um, no, I didn't go to Ingles, I'm sorry. I went to Food City and another local grocery store. Um, this isn't everything I need, but this is Sunday night after church, so I'll have to pick some more things up probably tomorrow or Tuesday, but, and I'll also share the meal plan. And some things I have in the freezer, like, um, deer steak and that stuff that's on the menu I've already got, so... We'll start with the cold stuff. So right here on the end, I have two one pound, little over one pound uh, chicken, boneless, skinless uh, chicken tenders. And then I picked up some ground chuck, a small pack. And then from Food City, I got two large packs of um, hamburger meat. And then we have 2% uh, milk, a, let's see what that is. I think it's eight pounds of potatoes. And we have some Atlantic salmon, and we've got some cubed and diced ham for salads. I've got some mozzarella and some mild cheddar for homemade pizza, and two packs of the Deli Deluxe American Cheese, and then a pack of the Kraft Singles American. I've got one pack of the, this is the already cooked, you just heat in the microwave, bacon, um, our boys really love that. I ate it too. It's pretty good. And then I didn't know it, but at both places I grabbed a pack of bacon um, for myself. And this is Hickory Smoked and that's Hometown Original. And I got two flats of eggs. Um, so the price of eggs are coming down where we're at, which I'm I'm so glad. So, and we I grabbed the boys each a barbecue chicken sandwich. And then me and my husband grabbed these Briars Carb Smart with only five net carbs um, to try. we I know I haven't said it on my channel yet, but um, starting in December, we started trying to make better choices and, you know, uh, choose healthier things and be more active. So, so far, so good. It's working. So, um, also, we got some Mayfield sherbet as a little treat every now and again. And then for the homemade pizza for the boys, um, they picked out turkey pepperoni. I also grabbed some of these um, hash rounds. I've been eating cereal every morning for breakfast. Cheerios or Honey Nut Cheerios. And I kind of wanted to change. And when I got to looking on these, they only have uh, 14 carbs for one. So that with some bacon will make a really good breakfast. Since I can't eat eggs, I wanted to change it up. I got a pack of hamburger buns for hamburgers. And then I also... I might have shared it. Um, I also use the buns to make like a little pizza, put some pizza sauce, some cheese, pepperoni, and bake in the oven for the boys. And I got some, um, just the white bread to make some French toast for our boys and also some grilled cheese sandwiches. I'm going to be doing some meal prep and I hope to get it on video and share that with you guys. 
but I've made it before make them some grilled cheese sandwiches and stick them in the freezer and that way it's quick easy lunches and then I grabbed two packs of the nature owns honey wheat bread it was buy one get one free I have four cans of the buttermilk jumbo biscuits um, we grabbed four cans of those and I have okay sorry about that guys and again, sorry about the lighting, but we got some Yo Play yogurts, strawberry smoothie, and blueberry smoothie um, for my boys, and then strawberry for my husband. They enjoy those. And I've got some Grand's Original to make some um, make ahead breakfast sandwiches bacon, egg, and cheese, sausage, and stick in the freezer for the boys for breakfast some mornings. I grabbed some bacon bits for my salad. We needed some mayonnaise, so we grabbed some Hellman's. I got a four pound bag of sugar for tea and Kool-Aid. Um, some pink lemonade Kool-Aid, my oldest son picked that out. I needed some self-rising flour, so we grabbed some of that. And I got some of this no sugar added ketchup to try. And I also picked up some of the Skippy no sugar added peanut butter. So I wanna make some um, like energy energy balls I think they call them with uh, oatmeal and peanut butter and honey so all the things I've got two packs of brown rice a box of popcorn there's a little um, thing with honey nut Chex mix that I'm gonna a snack that I was gonna make and then my youngest son picked out some barbecue Pringles and for snacks I got them some of the spring brownies. Those are so cute. I don't know if you can really tell, but flowers on them. Oh. And then my Otis picked out banana Twinkies. Loves the Twinkies. I just grabbed two boxes of the macaroni and cheese. They, my boys like that for lunch or as a side for supper. We have some spaghetti and meatballs. That'll be a quick lunch one day. I grabbed some black olives for the homemade pizza. Me and both the boys enjoy that. And then a couple of cans of cut green beans. I have 20 count of the Mission Fl Okay, I apologize once again. House phone ringing. But I've got a 20 count of the Mission Tortillas. And the my plan with these um, is to make some breakfast burritos for the freezer. And also, um, we have some ground chicken. I've got to buy some ground chicken and have some tacos. So... We have two packs of the buttermilk ranch. This is mine and my husband's favorite for our salads every day for lunch. I grabbed another thing of pizza sauce, a 24 pack of water, some sweet baby Ray's barbecue sauce. This is our favorite. And two cans of pet evaporated milk. So when I make uh, homemade potatoes or homemade gravy, this, yeah, I, I pretty much have to have that to make those things, but this was just part one like i said i didn't get everything i need but i i got most of it for the most part so so guys this is part two just a small haul to go with what i picked up yesterday um i had to get a couple of non-grocery items so i just grabbed a little box of uh dryer sheets from the dollar tree and then we all needed new toothbrushes so i grabbed those um and then i went in ingles and my oldest son wanted some stir fry so i got some stir fry chicken and then two packs of the ground chicken those make excellent tacos so and then i got some more mozzarella for some um their burritos breakfast burritos some more of the turkey pepperoni i want to make some pepperoni cheese crackers little uh snacks and then i have this um two pack of ribeye um, for my husband for lunch, supper, whatever he wants. And then my youngest son went in Ingles and seen these bunny chicks and eggs. They're marshmallow candy. And my mother-in-law used to get these every single year for Easter. So we continue with our boys. They both enjoy them. So I also picked up some chewy chocolate chips from Ingles. A small thing of the Daisy Sour Cream. My husband picked out these chocolate Johnny Pops to try, so we'll see. And then the Extreme Moose Tracks for our boys. 
We also got this meat tenderized seasoned, so we're going to try that. I got some bumblebee salmon to make some salmon patties, so, and then two things of Special K cereal. So guys, that's going to be the end of today's video. I appreciate so much your patience. Um, I'm sorry I didn't get a video out last week. It was just a busy week and I was really, really tired. So I actually had the video filmed and even uploaded, but I didn't have an outro and I didn't have it edited. So um, I thank you for your patience with that. I thank you guys for being here. I hope that it was, well, I did a little bit of cleaning, so maybe a little bit of motivation, but I appreciate each and every one of you, and if you haven't already and you like the content, please like, subscribe, comment, uh, all those things, and I hope you have a great day, and Lord willing, we'll see you in the next one. Be blessed.